you may have bought a similar graphic card like mine rx 7700 xt and you notice this game keeps on crashing over and over and it's really annoying but and i've spent every single day since i bought this graphic card trying to fix the errors on this game but yes some of this some of the methods i'm going to mention is going to sound really silly but since you guys have no options anyways and you're going to crash anyway so might as well give it a shot the first thing is you need to know why your gpu drivers are crashing Let's say if you have, like for me, I have dual monitors. So one monitor is at 1080p, 144Hz, and the other monitor is at 60Hz, 1600 to 900p. What happens is AMD drivers are so buggy, when you use two different resolutions and two different hertz, it just keeps on crashing the drivers. So if you're using dual monitors, you need to cap your frame rate of 50. That will because your other monitor only supports 60 while your other monitor supports 144. This is one of the ways that stop the crashes. Other thing is, let's say if you have, you have a stronger GPU, but a weaker CPU, max out or at least keep it on high, medium or high from everything related to GPU and everything related to CPU, keep it on low. And if you have a stronger CPU and a weaker GPU, just do the opposite. Now, the final thing which I can suggest is, is the most weird one I, I have found. And this one is going to sound the most silliest. I don't know how it worked. I was just messing around with mods and I've managed to fix it. Okay, next you need to download this mod called Playable Ellie. We're not actually going to be using Ellie as the main character. We just need 99% of the files. We just need to remove one file and that should fix the errors. At least it did for me. Second thing is you need NDARK, this thing. Make sure to download both of them and create a new folder, add all the files in one of them. So this file over here, you can find this file in the main folder. You go in the last of us folder, you'll see it right here. You just copy this to this folder right here and go back to your main folder and you see this thing called bin. Click on this, click on cut and then paste it here. Make sure you do not delete this because in case you want to roll back whatever you've done, you can just put it back, it'll be fixed. Next thing is you just drag this on NDARK and it'll extract the files. Then extract this, open this folder. Now in this folder, you're going to go here and you'll see look to Okay. Over here, you're going to delete characters.bin. You're going to copy this DC one and you're going to paste it here and overwrite the files. Now that that's done, you want to rename this to bin, okay? And I'm going to go in your main folder. So I already have the file here, but yeah, what you're going to do is you're going to copy this and then paste it here. You also make sure to copy this thing. I almost forgot. Copy this. Just make sure you make a backup of it just in case and then overwrite the files. And with that, I think it should fix because this is what I did. This is the three things that I did, which finally fixed all the crashes, all the bugs. I've been on Last of Us for five hours nonstop with not a single crash. And there's also another thing you can do. This didn't work for me, but it works for some people. So you can download this and disable MPO. And so this thing has fixed the issue for some people. For some, it hasn't. For me, it didn't. You can disable it and then restore it whenever. You just have to disable, restart your PC, and then you want to enable it again restore and then restart your pc uh hope this helps and make sure to like subscribe and everything all the good stuff bye bye